Hi guys, in this video tutorial I'm going to show you how to turn off automatic updates as well as how to update via Wi-Fi your books and synchronize your music and other stuff from your iTunes. Anyways, uh, for that we're going to go into settings. So once again, here's settings, so just click on it, open it up, and we're going to scroll down. Okay, you're going to scroll down all the way down until you see iTunes and App Store, so you're going to click on that. Okay, once you tap on that, you can go downwards, and here's your automatic downloads. So you can turn these off or on. Um, if you want your music to automatically sync with your iPhone over Wi-Fi, you're good to go. Um, from here, you can also set your cellular data. So if you don't want to use your data to sync up these things, you can turn that off. If you have unlimited, then it doesn't matter. You can just click on that. Um, for now, uh, my updates are actually turned off because I don't want that. I don't want my. I want to select which apps to update, not for them to just update by themselves. So I have it turned off. They're turned on once they're green. So all these are green. Um, and let's say you download an app on your iPhone and you'd want it on your iPad as well at the same time. Then if you have this on, then it will do that. Other than that, um, you want to turn it off. So I actually do want to turn it off right now. Um, I don't want all the apps that I have on my iPad on my iPhone. So I'm just going to turn that off. So I just slide this little circle to the left and that's about it. So if you want to turn off and on your updates, automatic updates, it's right here once again. Um, here's your music apps and books. And um, I'm actually going to turn this on because I don't care. There we go. Your iTunes match. So this is exactly what it says right here. It stores your music on on the cloud. Okay. Um, some of you may want that. Some of you may not. If you do that, you might end up wasting some of your space on the cloud. So I don't know. I just don't want to do it because I don't want to buy more more space. But if you guys got space and you bought it, then might as well do that. Um, something else that you guys want to look at. Once you're done that, just click on settings. Okay and go back into it and that's it that's all you're done for that if you guys have any questions comments not working properly for you or you're either on iOS 5 or 6 um, I do have other tutorials on that so you guys can get back to me for that um, that's about it for this video okay guys if you guys have any comments questions just write them down here and don't forget to rate and subscribe